Welcome to Ancient Egypt, a civilization that flourished along the banks of the Nile River for thousands of years. Today, we're going to explore what life was like for teenagers in this fascinating ancient world. Teenagers in ancient Egypt, much like today, had their own routines and responsibilities. Boys and girls both attended school, where they learned reading, writing and mathematics using tools like reed pens and papyrus scrolls. For boys, education often included training in their future professions. Sons of craftsmen would learn the family trade, while those of scribes or officials might continue their studies to enter the same prestigious roles. Girls, on the other hand, were usually taught domestic skills. They learned to manage a household, cook and weave. However, some girls from wealthier families could also receive a more formal education. But it wasn't all work and no play. Teenagers enjoyed various games and activities. Senet, a popular board game, was a favourite pastime. Swimming in the Nile and participating in lively festivals provided much-needed breaks from their daily routines. Religion played a significant role in their lives. Festivals honouring gods like Ra, Isis and Osiris were common, bringing the community together in celebration. These events were not only spiritual, but also social gatherings where teens could meet and interact. By their mid-teens, boys and girls were preparing for adulthood. Boys would begin working alongside their fathers, while girls were often married by the age of 14, ready to start their own families. Teenage life in ancient Egypt was a blend of education, work, play and preparation for the future. Though separated by thousands of years, the experiences of Egyptian teens echo the universal journey of growing up. Thank you for joining us on this journey through time. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more glimpses into the past.